The campaign for U.S. Senator is in high gear, and today Republican Pat Toomey campaigned in Pittsburgh his continued embrace of old view on hate crimes. Brought a, con a countercharge, I should say, from his opponent, Joe Sustak. Teddy K. Political Center John Delano is live now with more New at Six. Uh, Rick, the issue that divides the candidates tonight is hate crime. If someone is motivated to commit a crime because of the victim's race, gender, religion, religion or sexual orientation, that person can be charged with a federal hate crime. Some people think that's a problem because it implicates freedom of thought. One of those is Republican Senate candidate Pat Toomey, who today repeated a position he took in 2004 right here in Pittsburgh. Six years ago, Pat Toomey brought conservative judge Robert Bork to Pittsburgh to endorse his candidacy for Senate. At that press conference, Bork called hate crimes, quote, a discriminatory law enforcement device. Toomey agreed. This is an attempt to criminalize thought. It's an attempt to criminalize and add a, a dimension of punishment. That's why I think hate crime uh, legislation is wrong. The feds and almost all states have enacted hate crime legislation, adding a new charge and penalties for crimes motivated by a victim's race, religion, gender, and the like. I think it's a bad idea for the government to legislate based on what they think people are thinking, or what's in a person's mind or heart when they commit a crime. Uh, crime should be prosecuted for what's actually done, and they should be vigorously prosecuted. But Democrat Joe Sestak says hate crimes deserve special treatment. Those are so extremely offensive that that's why you have seen time and again Republicans and Democrats to say no. We want to make sure that that type of specific, focused, almost hatred, and that's what it is, is seen as even more offensive. We shouldn't have a system that's designed to say now, what was so-and-so thinking at the time he committed his crime, and let's punish him more or less depending on what we think the thought process, well, that's ridiculous. People should be punished for the crime they commit. Sestak says Toomey's view on hate crimes is just another sign of his extremism. Congressman Toomey is just so out of touch where mainstream Republicans and Democrats have always worked together on this. But Toomey says there's only one extremist in this race. Joe is to the left of the consensus of the Democratic Party. So I think Joe's a guy who's been pretty extreme. Now, I asked both candidates if they thought hate crime prosecutions are being brought unfairly in favor of one race or religion over another. Toomey said he didn't know. It was the whole concept he opposed. Sestak said if that was happening, it was wrong. Hate crimes must be brought equally regardless of who committed the crime. Live in the newsroom, I'm John Delano.